Hey guys, it's Tag Infusion. Today I'm going to teach you how to share screens between two Mac computers. These computers can be located anywhere as long as on Wi-Fi. Let's go ahead and jump right in. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to share screens using the iMessage app that comes on the Mac operating system or on any new Mac computer. So basically, the first thing you're going to want to do is launch messages on both computers. So now once messages is open, we can actually uh, come to a conversation or the person that you want to share the screens with, uh, come up to details, and um, then it will uh, you'll see this little icon right here. And you can do this on both computers as well, um, the icon right here. And if you click on the icon, you can uh, either say invite to share my screen or ask to share screen. So basically, I'm going to hit ask to share screen on this computer right here. And I'm just going to click ask to share screen. And now it will say tutorial would like to view your screen. And I hit accept. Now they're viewing my screen. And this is a pretty simple process and e very easy to do. Um, basically, I just show you how to do it in like 30 seconds. And now basically over here, I'm observing uh, the computer right here. Um, and I can point things out just like so. And then I can also uh, allow for on this computer, I can allow to uh, for this computer to control my screen. Um, now I can now this computer is controlling that screen over there. And that is a pretty cool feature in the Mac operating system. This has been available for some of the uh, versions, but they have actually improved this and make it made it more uh, stand out. This feature is a lot more visible now and easier to use. So now anyone can share screens and it doesn't have to be on the same Wi-Fi either. So that's awesome. You can do it from any place, any time, anywhere, as long as you do have a Wi-Fi connection. So once you're sharing screens, there's some of the, some little things that you can do. Um, of course, I can mute audio over here and pause the screen sharing. So if I want them to just not be able to control my computer for a second, I can actually pause it if I needed to get up and go away and I don't trust them as well uh, or as much. Um, but anyways, um, then I can unallow them to uh, share my screen and now they're observing again. So basically, that's how you share screens. And of course, it will go. It can go the other way. I just ended the screen share over here and now let me. I'm going to say ask or invite to share my screen. So now it's inviting uh, me over here to share this screen right here. So now I, I'm i sharing the screen over here and I'm going to actually allow to control the screen. So now I can control with this computer, this screen over here. So this is a really cool feature and I would definitely recommend checking this out. This is going to expand the uh, world of helping others and uh, just, you know, pointing out problems and helping out, helping solve computer issues between friends, between other contacts, and this is just a really cool, really awesome feature. And I would definitely recommend checking it out. So yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please remember to leave a like and don't forget to comment, subscribe. And yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next video.